So we want to measure acceleration due to gravity and the most simple way to do that is to use the simple pendulum. And in that we'll have a mass on a string that's going to oscillate back and forth and back and forth. And the crucial thing is that we want to understand the forces on the mass at all points. And if we do that and if we, we, we understand those forces, then we can, uh, we can describe mathematically the period of oscillation, which is the time taken for it to go back and forth to the same point. And we'll see that it's written in terms of the length of the string and also a constant acceleration due to gravity. So we have two variables and one constant. So if we measure the period t for a number of different string lengths, l, then we can uh, we'll see that we can make a plot and we'll be able to determine from the slope of that plot the acceleration due to gravity. So here we have the central equation for this experiment. Because we can measure things and our unknown is contained in here. So what we will do in the experiment is we will measure the period of oscillation for a different length, lengths of string. And we'll be able to construct a graph that relates these two objects, or these two terms, and uh, the, un the only unknown will be g, acceleration due to gravity.